Objectivism, The Philosophy of Ayn Rand, by Leonard Peikoff is a comprehensive and illuminating exploration of Ayn Rand's philosophical system, Objectivism. In this analysis, we will delve into the key themes, arguments, and the significance of Peikoff's work. The book serves as an authoritative guide to understanding objectivism, a philosophy that has had a profound impact on American thought and culture. Leonard Peikoff, a close associate of Ayn Rand, takes on the task of elucidating Rand's philosophy in a systematic and rigorous manner. He begins by providing a concise overview of objectivism, making it accessible to both newcomers and those familiar with Rand's work. This introductory section serves as a valuable foundation for readers. One of the central tenets of objectivism is its emphasis on reason as the primary means of acquiring knowledge. Peikoff underscores this principle throughout the book, arguing that reason is the fundamental tool for understanding reality. He meticulously explains how reason leads to objective ethics, which are rooted in the objective nature of reality. This ethical framework is in stark contrast to religious or altruistic philosophies, which objectivism vehemently rejects. Peikoff further elucidates objectivism's ethics by exploring the concept of rational self-interest. He contends that individuals should pursue their own rational self-interest unapologetically. Objectivism advocates for a morality based on the recognition that one's life and well-being are the ultimate values. This stance has sparked intense debates and discussions, making it one of the most controversial aspects of Rand's philosophy. The author also delves into politics, arguing for a laissez-faire capitalist system as the only political system consistent with objectivist principles. Peikoff passionately defends individual rights and limited government intervention, asserting that this approach fosters economic prosperity and individual freedom. He critiques the welfare state and collectivist ideologies, asserting that they undermine individual rights and personal responsibility. Peikoff's analysis extends to aesthetics, where he explores the role of art in human life. Objectivism champions romanticism in art, asserting that it celebrates human values and ideals. The book explains how art, according to Rand, should inspire and uplift, reflecting the heroic potential of individuals. This perspective on aesthetics underscores the holistic nature of objectivism, where every aspect of human existence is seen as interconnected. Throughout the book, Peikoff also engages with and addresses common misconceptions and criticisms of objectivism. He refutes the notion that objectivism promotes selfishness in the negative sense, arguing that rational self-interest is fundamentally different from irrational egoism. Additionally, he defends the philosophy against claims of dogmatism, asserting that objectivism encourages independent thinking and rational inquiry. One of the strengths of Peikoff's work is his ability to contextualize objectivism within the broader history of philosophy. He traces the intellectual roots of objectivism, from Aristotle to Enlightenment thinkers, highlighting how Rand's philosophy is both a departure from and an evolution of these traditions. This historical perspective adds depth and legitimacy to objectivism as a philosophical system. Objectivism, the philosophy of Ayn Rand, is not merely an abstract exploration of ideas, it also addresses the practical implications of objectivism in everyday life. Peikoff discusses how individuals can apply objectivist principles to their personal and professional lives, emphasizing the importance of rationality, integrity, and productive achievement. In conclusion, Leonard Peikoff's Objectivism the philosophy of Ayn Rand provides a comprehensive and rigorous analysis of Ayn Rand's objectivist philosophy. It elucidates the core principles of reason, rational self-interest, individual rights, and laissez-faire capitalism. 
By addressing common misconceptions and placing objectivism in historical context, Peikoff's work serves as a valuable resource for both those new to the philosophy and those seeking a deeper understanding. This book is not only a tribute to Ayn Rand's intellectual legacy but also a testament to the enduring influence of objectivism on modern philosophy and culture.